an oblivious reverend searching for the mystical Garden of Eden, a Manx crew compelled by dubious circumstance to accept despised English passengers, a peaceable civilization's way of life threatened by callous, uncomprehending settlers. My name's Christine and my good book recommendation for today is Matthew Neal's English Passengers. English Passengers is a clever, witty and moving novel. One of its great appeals is its ingenious style. Set in the 1850s, the many narratives are woven through the story by means of diverse voices, each with a distinct and differing viewpoint. In juxtaposition to the exploits of the English passengers on board the Manx ship Sincerity, bound for Tasmania, is the fate of the Aborigines themselves. The destructive effects of the white settlers on the Aborigine population and the portrayal of the widely different, differing perspectives of the people and the settlers is masterful. The immense gulf of understanding between the two cultures is painfully exposed. Matthew Neal cleverly draws together the distinct threads of the plot to a masterly and comical culmination on Tasmania, with the final adept resolution, a fitting end to his characters and to a brilliant book. English Passengers is brimming with comedy and exceptional characters while starkly and gravely pointing out the horrors and callousness of colonisation. A justifiably award-winning novel, I'd highly recommend it. Happy reading.